Hi, Dick Rotman here, aboard 629 Sierra Tango, left Camarillo a short time ago and uh, proceeded up toward uh, Reno where there was some weather. The, the exercise today is uh, um, working with weather equipment on board, basically mostly Nexrad and color weather radar. And um, that's compromising our fuel to destination. So we've turned back and uh, they've offered us direct Las Vegas, direct Rocky Mountain Regional. We asked for direct. Looks like we might be stopping for fuel here either way. Um, uh, turned through the tailwind. I've got uh, less of a tailwind now than we would have Remember, three zero three Mike Tango. had otherwise. Zero. The reason for that was restricted zero. airspace, we're told. And that's fine. Go ahead. The good Remember, news is three zero three Mike Tango puts us uh, buoy, bravo, through some posture, weather, which posture, was the echo, absolute echo, direct bison, bison. Uh, thing we wanted to do. So, in general, we, we've got some of this weather in view already, so Mark II eyeballs are telling me, you know, we're going to be doing some maneuvering through here. Next rad is a strategic tool. This is telling me that there's enough room between these, most of which aren't uh, producing any lightning. Uh, there's enough maneuvering through there that we'll be able to wiggle our way through. And the only hitch is we may be restricted on the wiggling because of the restricted spaces that we lost. So let's see how it goes, but we're off to Las Vegas. And we've got the weather radar turned on, but we're still not close enough for that to be used as a uh, tactical tool, which is how we intend to use it. Remember, NEXRAD is, while it is indeed a radar product, it's old. It's older than four minutes in this case because there's processing time. And it's very low resolution, somewhere around 2,000 meters. So it's for those two reasons definitely not to be used for tactical weather avoidance. We're going to use the color weather radar for that. Wingspan 95 of the that radar is coming to the cockpit at 186,000 miles per second. Just a good idea. It's the law. Dick Rochford, fly safely. Train off it. 